These are the top 10 questions that you will be asked during a job interview. What's up, everybody? This is your boy, Tech G, back with another video. And in this video, we're going to be talking about what are the top 10 cybersecurity questions that you will be asked during a job interview. And this is more so in particular to those of you who are getting your career started in IT because you probably fall into one of two categories. You are entertaining the idea of transitioning into IT and going into cybersecurity. Security. You're currently out there studying so you can go get your certifications or you are about to go take your test to pass your certification and then go to the next level of trying to find a job. Now, that's all fine and dandy. You're doing all the right things. You're researching, you're studying, going out there to get those certs. But that job interview can be a make or break for a lot of you if you guys don't know what the heck you're supposed to say during these job interviews. And I know a lot of y'all think that, hey, I got the certs. I'm good money out in these streets. That's all I need. And in some cases, that might be all you need. But I'm here to tell you, in most cases, you're going to have to go in there and kind of display to whoever's interviewing you that you actually know what the heck you're talking about. And you didn't just shove a bunch of information to your brain to go pass a test. So with that being said, let's talk about what are the 10 most asked cybersecurity questions that you may come across during a job interview. And so we're going to head on over to this website called Analytics Insight, where somebody posted this article titled Top 10 Most Asked Cybersecurity Questions in Interviews. So let's check out what they're talking about. So these questions can help you ace your cybersecurity interview. So cybersecurity is the only area of IT that has yet to experience a downturn. Basically, that means there are tons and tons of cybersecurity jobs to the point where it's estimated that there are like half a million unfilled cybersecurity jobs out there. So if you're looking to get into this industry, there's a high chance you will find a job. It says with increased demand comes more competition and to secure a job in cybersecurity, you must be amongst the best. While having the essential cybersecurity abilities is half the battle won, Getting through the interview is another story entirely. And then it goes on to say, we've put together a list of the 10 most asked cybersecurity questions to help you ace your interview. But before we do that, let's read a bit about its basics. Now, what this person said is absolutely true, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, you need to have the book smarts and the knowledge and the certifications and all that stuff. But when you're going to these interviews, you are selling yourself. You are trying to convince that person that you are the best person for this job and you are a proper fit for that company or whatever it is that you're doing. So keep that in mind, ladies and gentlemen, you can go in there and wow them over with all your knowledge. But at the end of the day, do they actually like you is one of the most important things that takes place during a job interview. Keep that in mind. Article goes on to say cybersecurity is the process of preventing hostile assaults on Internet linked systems like mobile devices, computers, servers, electronic systems, networks and data. Cybersecurity is divided into two categories, cyber and security. The term cyber encompasses a wide spectrum of technologies, including computers, networks, software and data. In contrast, security is concerned with the protection of systems, networks, services and data. In some cases, it is also referred to as electronic data security or information technology security. That is essentially what cybersecurity is in a nutshell. All right, so we're going to go ahead and skip to the good stuff that you came here for. What are the 10 most common questions? So they say question number one is this. What is cryptography? And according to this article, it says cryptography is the practice and study of ways for securing communication and information with the goal of protecting data from third parties who aren't supposed to have access to it. That is question number one in regards to what is cryptography. Photography. Go ahead and write that down and memorize it. Question two, what is the difference between symmetric and asymmetric encryption? Go ahead and take a screenshot of this where they talk about symmetric encryption and asymmetric encryption. Symmetric encryption is basically the same key for deciphering and encrypting information. The encryption is faster than asymmetric encryption and it uses the algorithms AES, DES, Triple DES, and RC4. So do you have asymmetric encryption that's different
different keys for decrypting and encrypting information. The encryption process is slower and it uses the Diffie-Hellman and the RSA algorithm. So once again, go ahead and write this down, take a screenshot, do whatever it is you got to do. Next question, what does SSL stand for? Security Sockets Layer. You've been out there studying, doing your A+, plus, Net+, plus, Security+, plus. you already knew the answer to that. Next question, how is hashing different from encryption? So it says to turn readable data into an unreadable form, both hashing and encryption are utilized. The distinction is that encrypted data can be decrypted and transformed back to the initial data, whereas hash data cannot be transformed back to the initial data. That is the difference between hashing and encryption. What's a firewall? All of y'all should know this, but in case you don't, a firewall is a network security tool that monitors and regulates network traffic at the system or perimeter. Network firewalls are primarily used to defend the system or network from viruses, worms, malware, and other malicious software. Next, we have what is the difference between VA and PT? VA is vulnerability assessment and PT is penetration testing. So vulnerability assessment assessment. This is the process of identifying weaknesses in a target. The organization recognizes that its systems or network has defects or vulnerabilities and wishes to identify and prioritize these flaws for correction. And then the process of detecting vulnerabilities on a target, this is known as penetration testing. In this situation, the business would have put in place all of the security precautions they could imagine and would want to see if their system or network could be compromised in any other method. So that is a common common question that they are saying you're going to come across. What is the difference between vulnerability assessment and penetration testing? Next question it says, what are the different types of response codes that a web application can send? You got the answers of 1XX for informational responses, 2XX for success, 3XX for redirection, 4XX for client side errors, and 5XX for server side errors. So that is the different types of response codes from a web application. Question number eight, they say you need to know what is a trace route. And trace route, this is the utility that displays a packet's journey. It lists all of the locations, mostly routers, through which the packet goes. This is typically used when a packet fails to reach its intended destination. All right. Question nine, they're saying you need to know what are the elements of cybersecurity? You got operational security, application security, information security, network security, end user education, and business continuity planning. So that is the ninth question. They say you need to know when you go sit down for a job interview. And then the final question they saying that you may be asked during a job interview is what is a V? VPN. And all of you should know by now that VPN stands for Virtual Private Network. It allows users to connect their computers to a local network and establish a secure link that masks their IP address, letting you share files and access the internet privately while protecting your online identity. All right, that is what they're saying, what a VPN is. And once again, ladies and gentlemen, these are the top 10 most asked cybersecurity questions that you may come across in a job interview. Now, like I said earlier, ladies and gentlemen, you going out there studying, taking your exams, passing your certifications, that's only one part of the battle towards you kicking off your illustrious career in cybersecurity and information technology in general. One of the most important factors when it comes for you to get a job in IT is you successfully passing those job interviews, because not only are you going in there to demonstrate how much knowledge do you actually have and do you actually understand this knowledge, but most importantly, you are in there to sell yourself, to convince the interviewer that you are a likable person. You are a decent person to be around that will fit into this company and go out there and do whatever it is that they are trying to pay you to do. You have to sell yourself. You have to convey the warm and fuzzies during this job interview you, ladies and gentlemen. So keep that in the back of your mind as you're going out there trying to kick off 2022 and get this whole cybersecurity career thing on and popping. Know your information. 
get your certifications, but also go in there and successfully ace these job interviews. And with that being said, they're saying that you need to know these questions because out of all the job interviews that have been conducted and whoever put this survey together, they're saying that these were the top 10 most asked questions. So now you have the answers. Now you can go forth and be great and kick off this career in cybersecurity. And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy Tech G. If you felt like you've gotten something valuable out of this video, hit the like button, share button, drop a comment, but most importantly, subscribe to this channel. And with that, I will highlight you on the next video. Peace.